And yet, when you start talking about the legacy of Logan, one name jumps to the top of the list. That, of course, is Hugh Jackman, who has portrayed the mutant hero on the big screen since 2000. Here's Hugh reminiscing about the early days and discovering the character of Wolverine. I don't think I fully understood what it meant to the wider world. I was not a, a comic book fan in particular growing up. I, I had never heard of X-Men. And, and in some ways, I'm really glad I didn't know because I really approached Logan as I would any other character. Yes, he had claws coming out of it. Yes, he could heal himself and he had kind of crazy hair. But for me, it was just another character to embody and all the humanness of him. But because I said, as an actor, I work as much on the voice and the physicality of any part I play. And on film, obviously, it's your eyes, but it's every part of you you got to use. And as soon as I was looking at these brilliant, beautiful images, I was like, look at the economy. They can sell an entire action sequence with 12 images. And it was about marginalized communities and minorities and all of this stuff. And look how unique they were and where he was and how he stood and with the animal side to him. And so I was playing with all of that. I was in a room working on it. So all of those poses and all the things I did was everything taken off, off the comic books. So Kevin was an assistant for Lauren uh, Shula Donna, who was the producer. And I remember going into his office and it was wall to wall comic action figures. I'd never seen anything like it. So he was my go-to for really getting the background, really getting the history. At the end of that audition, I said, I I'm going to go to the airport. And Kevin said, I I'll drive you to the airport. Let's grab some dinner. I'll drive you to the airport. I was like, mate, you don't... I said to him, it's okay. We all know what's going on here. Like, it's nice, but you don't do it. And he goes, no, 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 I want to. So he didn't just drive me to the airport. He took me to a steak restaurant, bought me a steak. I'm an actor. I was like, awesome, I'll take a free steak. And we sat there and we had a, an hour and a half at a steak restaurant. And then he went, dropped me off at the curbside. And I, I remember just saying, this is great to meet you. I'm not sure if I'll ever see you again, probably not. And he goes, you never know, man. And why does it touch me? Because it really, at that time, was a one in a million chance that I was playing Wolverine. Could he easily have got a driver to take me to the airport? And would almost every other person who was working hard on a movie get the driver to take me to the airport? Absolutely. But he was just like a mensch. He's a mensch.